Hey, I'm Robert Irvine. And I'm Nelson Aguilar, and you're joining us with Bites with Birds. And guess what? Today, we're going to make you a what we call a bird-in-the-hand taco. Yes, that's English version for taco. All right, so we're going to use um, the chicken thigh because that's the most fat. But we're going to make Jamaican jerk chicken. So all I've done is rub the chicken with uh, jerk spices, a little oil, put it in the oven, and cooked it till it's literally cooked. All we do then is shred the chicken, and that's what I have here, shredded chicken. So to start with, I'm going to turn on the heat, get that nice and warm, little chicken stock or water. And then we're just going to reconstitute this. In other words, you know, when chicken gets dry, or as it gets cold, I should say, not dry, it starts to tighten up. The protein gets tight and it becomes chewy. So we have to make sure that, that this is not chewy because we're going to eat into the taco. So are we so, rehydrating this chicken? Basically, yes. There's still moisture in it, but I want it to be nice and succulent. So that's what we're going to do with that. A little chicken stock. In here, we have red cabbage. We're going to make a little slaw. We want bite and texture to this. So we're going to add some red wine vinegar. Put a little bit of salt and pepper in there, if you would. You learn fast. I like this. I like this, yeah. I wonder if I will be as fast as football as you are at cooking. You will. I'll be your teacher. Oh, you know what they say? When a student is ready, the teacher appears. There you have it. I'm the student. I'm ready. Okay, I've got to ask you one question. What do you like to eat on game days? Mm. Well, sticking with chicken, my favorite dish on game day has to be yellow rice and chicken. Oh, so you like, you like rice with chicken, carbohydrates? Is that what that's yeah. for? Or? Yeah. I don't even know if it's for that. I just love it. And is that, is that like a, a comfort food for you? Yeah, it's a, uh, you know, I'm from Tampa, Florida, and, you know, my godmother used to always make that for me in high school. And from there on, I, I had to have it. Like the yellow rice and chicken with a side of plantains. Ooh, it, it was a must. Have you ever made, have you, do you like lasagna? I do. Have you, if you ever made la lasagna with plantain as the pasta, get rid of the pasta, slice the plantains, and it's, it's amazing. Sweet plantains. It's amazing. Any type of planting. All right. All right. Avocado. Peel the avocado, smush the avocado. I'm going to come on this side of you. So with tacos, we need a nice salsa. But this time, we, we, I'm almost going Caribbean, right? Jamaican jerk chicken. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to add some mangoes. Ooh. Now look, mangoes, those are must-have for me. Favorite fruit all oh. time. Why? I Just you like the flavor? No. I mean, growing up, mango, we had a mango tree in our backyard, and mangoes are a must for me. So we've got mango, we've got pineapple for sweetness, red peppers, some onions, a little chili flake. Where are you right now? I'm here. The pit. You're my pit guy. Well, you just made a mess of it this time. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. just chill, just chill. I can, I can fix this. Okay, I can all right. fix this. In the so, game of football, you have to improvise all the time. I like this. Because coverages, you know, they roll, defensive make plays too, so you just gotta react. You can't just go with what's on script. I feel a little like I should have done something different now. No, that's all right. All right. all right, all right. All right, so I got some cilantro, tomatoes, mangoes, pineapple, onions, a little red chili flake, but some spice. I'm gonna mix that up in a minute when you mix the, uh, when you mix the avocado. I have another question. Hit me. You want to watch Don't him? physically hit me. I though, would never hit you. You're, strong. You're, you're like a superstar. Here. See? I was there. The wingman was there. The wingman, not the pit man. The wingman. You're actually the leader of this thing. Was there. All right. And the city of Philadelphia, I mean, talk about resilience and, and, and sports-loving fan. I mean, they either love it or they hate it, right? There's no in-between with Philly fans. Well, they love their sports. They're, they don't hate their sports. They may... They may come at you <laughs> if you don't help them love their sport, but they love their sport. All right, so I'm just going to show you this while, while you're mixing up for a second. You know, um, I use a big knife, but you know, uh, mangoes have a big pit in the middle here. That's why we never use uh, a spoon. The quickest way to take a mango out, obviously, is like this with a butter knife. All you're doing is scoring it. You're never going to cut yourself with a butter knife. Take a spoon. And it's already diced for you, look. Mm. Already done. Now, quick.
quickest, easiest way to do a mango. All right, so all we've done, we got all the, all the pieces ready, right? And again, this can be done. We can roast the chicken the day before. Um, on a Monday, we're going to serve it on a Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, no matter what. Rewarm it with the, with the stock. I've literally just warmed the uh, tortillas. And the way we're going to serve this is kind of like this. Look, we start with a little avocado. And we'll take a little bit of our... Hold on, hold on. Is that mine? Yeah. I want more avocado. You got me? There we have it. Need it I'll tell you, I'll tell you, you're a fussy guy, man. You're <laughs> fussy. Do you want more of this? Let's see. I want to see what right. it looks like. A little salsa. Oh, yeah. A bit of cabbage. That's got our red vine vinegar in it. Then we go into... Hold on, hold on. If you're vegan, you can eat this, right? Yeah. All right, so vegan viewers, you can have this. <laughs> Non-vegan viewers. You can have this. We just remove this. <laughs> you can, listen, we can make this with fish, we can make it with shrimp, we can make it with, with, with just vegetables if you want. Mm -hmm. It really is, we can use flour tortillas, corn tortilla, wheat tortillas. You can even make your own. Chicken. Mm. Don't tell me you want more. Mm, I'm okay with that. Who cook? Do you cook at home? Yeah. So you don't want me to come over and cook for you? I you definitely want you to come over. All right, look, all we have to do, now here's a, here's a little tip. If you ever want to get juice out of citrus, lemon juice, lime juice, grapefruit juice, microwave these for a couple of minutes, right? So they get nice and pliable. But when you cut through them, remember it's hot liquid inside. Mm. But this stuff, the white, the pith, P-I-T-H, is where all the flavor is. I'm just gonna, Bum. Wipe the plate again, because I just made a mess. There we go. I'm Robert Irvine. I'm Nelson Aguilar, and this has been Bites with Birds. See you next time.